Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Trophy Fishing 2. Where today I've set myself with three goals, which is our first goal is to be um to catch a fish that is not a perhana. Our second goal is to catch a perhana we've never caught before. And our third goal will be to catch a Paku. Guys, I did record like a 24 minute episode. There we go. First goal done. Oh my god. Finally. <laughs> After catching so many Perhanas, our first goal is done, which is to catch a fish that is not a Perhana. As you guys remember, previous episode, all we did was catch Perhanas, all different types, which is cool. But come on, like I, I need something different, right? Uh, so this episode, finally, right off the bat, we've completed our first quest, uh, first task. Our second task, catch a different species of Perhana that we've not caught before in the first episode. And then try to catch a Paku. Um, I just recorded a 24 minute episode right here. Unfortunately, my... Something happened with the sound system, with the headset or the mic or OBS, and it screwed up. And even though I have the entire episode recorded, there is no volume to it, and that just killed me. So, <laughs> so let's do it another time. Let's do it again. Um, I'm just happy that I ended up catching something other than a Perhana. Because I really... Didn't think I'd be able to catch something other than a Perhana. Uh, but here we are. There we go. What is this going to be? Another high water. So at night time with red worms at bottom fishing, we are catching high waters. Uh, so that's good. I'm happy for that. We're catching something other than Perhanas. Now, the episode that did not make it, I did hook on to two monster fish that spooled me. One of them I did see. It came up and it was, I think it was a, a high water or a catfish. And it was pretty darn big. And it was again on the red worm and a medium sized hook. Uh, potatoes I've used here, extremely, extremely active. And again, I got big fish on the potatoes. I got spooled right away. So I ended up changing uh, the potatoes because it works way too well. We need a better setup to uh, go with it. Guys, I really hope you uh, sit back, relax, and watch the entire video. And if you're enjoying it, and if you have enjoyed it, uh, please like, please comment below what you think, uh, any suggestions what I should do next. And uh, if this is your first time and you're not a part of the family here, uh, please subscribe for more awesome content uh, that I will, that I keep providing. Uh, fishing games, indie games, games that look really cool, something, you know, like games that are very different. I check them all out. Very busy schedule for me as I got so many games I need to show you guys and stream. <gasps> Whoa. That is probably from the Cichlid family. <gasps> oh my god, 154 silver. That's insane. Wow. Kokyutaya. My Myersy. Mercy, Mercy. Oh my god, I did not expect that. That was, that might have been the most insane catch I've ever done in this game. Besides catching what, our biggest fish is, fish is an 8 kg fish. This is easily the most expensive fish we've ever caught. And I think that's an extremely rare fish because it's worth so much. Uh, so there you go. Nile River or no. Not Nile, Amazon is just amazing. It's just dishing out everything it has at us. All the piranhas, the big fish, the expensive fish. <laughs> um, two of our goals have been done already. All we need is a Paku. I don't think I'm going to be able to catch a Paku. Because uh, I think you need, I don't know, maybe a special type of bait for that. But this 
Red worm is a universal bait. It should catch everything. Another high water. It is nighttime, so I guess they are very active. You know what? In order to avoid them, I'm going to do it to medium depth. After we catch this fish, we will change it to medium depth and go from there. You know what, though? Our Perhana streak is over because even in the episode that did not make it, I caught so many Perhanas that it's insane. And I got different species of Perhanas too. Oh wait, wasn't that our second goal? Catch a different type of Perhana? Yes, that was. So we only completed one goal. Catch a fish that is not a Perhana. And then the other two goals are still remaining. Okay, I completely forgot. <laughs> So uh, two goals are still left. I think catching a different type of Perhana is going to be easy. All we got to do is, I guess, wait till daytime. Okay. For a second, I thought that was a big fish. It just went down so quick. No, I don't remember what kind of Perhanas I caught. Oh my god. Makafisi. All of a sudden, we're catching all these different types of fish. I can't believe it. What's going on? I think the Perhanas go to sleep at late night into early morning. And I think that's the only time we're going to be able to catch things other than Perhanas. Because we fished during the day in the last episode. All we got were Perhanas. And uh, the episode that did not make it out was early evening. Uh, I got everything but Perhanas. And this episode, right off the bat, no Perhanas at all. So even if we don't complete the second goal, I really don't care. Now, uh, the episode again, the episode that did not make it, I did catch two or three different types of Perhanas. So I'm hoping that we can catch a cool Perhana here. Okay. Damn it, we're gonna get spooled. I gotta do Hulk mode. <gasps> Whoa, bolt catfish. Oh my God, I'm so happy. I'm so happy we're catching all of these different types of fish. Oh my God, yes. Uh, oh, everything but the perhanas. I can't believe it. So let's, let's keep using the red worms because they're very effective. They're giving us different types of fish. You know what, I want to go into my profile and I want to see how many different types trophies have I caught so far. 20, 30, 50? I think 20 to 30, I would say. Maybe 30 to 40, I don't know, I don't remember. Because I've been playing this game for a long time. Like once a week I'll play, right? So, what, we're at episode 8 or something look at this guy he's half a kg and worth 81 this guy's insane okay while we wait for the fish profile come on baby tell me where trophies uh not caught 1581 trophies not caught but how many trophies have i caught look at this Look at the price on this guy. Mandarin fish, Lanuk. Damn. We go by the way. Look at this 5.4 kg channel catfish. I can't believe I got. Oh, sorry. 1.9 kg is the biggest. What? Hold on. 2.5 kg Mandarin fish is the biggest one I've ever caught, I guess. I thought I got like a 5 or 6 kg fish. That's disappointing. Um. It still won't tell me how many trophies I've caught. Like, I'm not going to count all of these fish because that's just stupid. Okay, decent sized fish. This could be a Perhana here. Black Paku. I freaking can't believe it, guys. We got a Paku. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. What an insane episode. I felt so defeated. Because I spent, you know, like 30, 35 minutes uh, setting up, recording the previous episode. 
And then after finishing, you know, I was so happy I accomplished something and I went in to check the episode and it had no volume and I just felt, oh my god, no, not again. Um, you know, it's happened once before, long time ago. But man, we came back and we're just killing it. I can't believe it. We are just killing it. We got so many different species of fish. And then we got a Paku as well. Two of our goals are finally complete. One goal remaining is to catch a, uh, a Perhana. A species of Perhana we haven't caught before. Honestly, I don't even care anymore. <laughs> I am just so happy. Oh, yes. Black Paku. There are more types of Pakus. Uh, I can already see in the chat there is... Uh, orange spotted Paku, that looks really cool. Imagine orange spots on a, you know, like a black colored Paku. That would be so, so cool. Such strong, I guess, contrast. Or what the right word is, but orange is so bright and then black is so dark. It, man, it'll be so cool. I want to see that fish. Okay, another one here. <gasps> Whoa. Pike cichlid. It's like a pike and a cichlid. Oh my god, we're catching all the fish this episode. I can't believe it. This is just insane. Guys, I'm just using a red worm and medium sized hook. That's it. Uh, also, I ended up buying 2,500 silver worth of semolina and 2,500. Silver worth of pearl barley, which is 5,000 silver in total. Oh my god, we are on a roll. We ta-ta. Just insane. I don't even need other lures. Our XP still needs to go a long way. We are not even halfway through. And once we level up, we can finally buy a 5 kg rod. Uh, which is an upgrade to our 3 kg rod since we struggle with 1 kg fish. Uh, but Amazon is just amazing. This is Amazon, right? Yep, Amazon River. Okay, another tiny fish here. What is this guy gonna be? A what? Uh, what? A severum? Look at the coloration of this magnificent 0 0.043 kg beast. Wow. This guy's only 4 grams? Or 43 grams. I think that this guy's 43 grams. And look at how beautiful this fish looks. Oh my god. Man, if we were doing the fish bowl right now, it would have been insane. Wow, I can't believe it. Just trophy after trophy after trophy. Uh, high water. Then we got the Kokutata. And then let me just look at the chat once we catch this fish. A toucan fish? Are you serious right now? Oh my god, look at the... The, the scales on this guy. Ugly fish, but I like the colors. Damn. We got the high water. We got the Misiri. Then we got the Maka fish. The catfish. The bolt catfish. The Paku. Pike cichlid. The Vitata. Um, Severum and Toucan fish. That's seven different species of fish we've caught. And for a second, I thought we were going to get spooled here. Okay, what is this guy going to be? Yes. Look at this guy, 83 silver. Heck yeah. Man, this fish is amazing. Look at how expensive it is. Um, but man, I, I got to say, guys, this has been the best episode ever. You know, last episode, we caught all the cichlids, sorry, not all the cichlids, all the, all the piranhas, amazing episode, I loved it. Um, and then I had the failed episode I made, which was pretty good. 
uh but then you know i went through a low note because it was a failure i no volume and then damn i just can't believe it we're catching some amazing fish bucktooth tetra why don't we have this in the aquatic industry maybe can't live in aquariums it is a tetra so that means it's a tiny fish we do have a few different types of tetras in the aquatic world uh so neon tetras we also have neon tetras are just goofy looking things very colorful um are they have they been modified though because their colors look a little too crazy but yeah stellar episode i really hope i've captivated you guys enough to for you to be watching 15 almost 16 minutes into this episode I would really appreciate it if you watch the whole thing. Because view times are a real thing here. Look at this. We keep catching different types of fish. This is such a boring looking fish. It looks like a roach, but it's worth 20 silver. That's pretty darn good. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to say view times matter a lot. And like RF4, you know, hotspot videos, people only watch the first five seconds and then they leave, even though the video is two minutes long. And that really hurts. Especially 20 to 30 minute episodes that I do, I really hope people are watching them because view times are not too great, but they also don't tell the main picture. Like, I don't know how many people are watching the whole episode and how many people are watching two minutes. And how many people are just like, oh, wrong video. Okay, let's go back. And that counts as, you know, zero minutes watched, maybe. Uh, so it's really hard to tell. Uh, but when I do see a, a view times of a video that are in the four or five minutes or more, it's just amazing. Uh, another one, 12 silver. I will take it. Uh... Isn't this funny, guys? Where the where are the piranhas? I think I just need to switch it out, or maybe I just need to wait for them to start biting again, time wise. Uh, but this is funny. Yes, yeah. Two episodes. One episode is on YouTube. One episode is in the dump, the garbage. The recycling bin, both episodes I got boatloads of uh, piranhas, and all of a sudden then this episode we're not getting anything uh, in terms of piranhas. So maybe we can switch this out. You know what? Yeah, let's switch this out. Let's catch one more fish. As much as I'm going to catch different species of fish, I want to use the other, other bait. What is this going to be? Another pike cichlid. Look at this. 0. 0.7, 700 grams almost and 103. Amazon is amazing. No other map comes close to this. Uh, medium bites, pearl barley, trophy chance is higher. Semolina, you can catch even the most small. Cool, let's go with Semolina here. And I'm sure it catches everything, right? Yep. All right, let's try this. Uh, Semolina, Semonella, Simona. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever brings the fish to the yard. Severe thunderstorm watch in effect. Nice. While I was recording, while I'm recording this video, I got an alert from my phone. And it's telling me uh, severe thunderstorms probably incoming for us. We're going to get a decent amount of rain by the looks of it, which is good. Because the plants need it. And I'm off today, so I don't care if it rains. 22. Okay, I mean, that's a good fish to catch because it's too expensive. But I want something else. I want the piranhas from the Amazon. You guys know what I'm imitating, right? It's the girl from uh, Finding Nemo. She comes to the dentist. 
and uh, she has braces on <laughs> and she's like I'm a perhana from the Amazon and yeah you guys even remember uh, Finding Nemo 2 like the first one captivated the world it was an amazing movie everyone loved it oh wow wow look at this pike cichlid dwarf pike cichlid it looks amazing damn and after so many years they finally released finding nemo 2 and unfortunately it was a good movie but it was a forgettable one it was nowhere close to as good as the original oh go oh. And uh, that's the issue when uh, the first movie you make is so good, it has such high expectations that your second movie usually doesn't live up to it. It's very hard to. And that's why we don't have Half-Life 3. R.I.P. and pepperonis. <laughs> oh, man. But, oh, man, I like this bite rate. It's very fast. And it's not like we're getting boring fish either. Amazon cichlid. Heck yes. Amazing. Oh, my God. Wow. I'm loving this, guys. I just... Oh, my God. You know what, guys? Um, This is going to be our last fish. And then next episode, I'm going to keep fishing. And I'm going to see what we can get. Because this just keeps going on and on and on. And there's still so many species of fish. So unfortunately, our second goal of this episode was a failure. We didn't even catch a perhana this episode. Can you believe that? Can, like, I can't believe that because I was having such a hard time catching anything but piranhas and all of a sudden now we're catching everything but piranhas so that's great um i will see you in the next episode thank you so much for watching for tuning in and until the next time guys enjoy